be great support. They will talk about the most important skills and advices to work in the field of the quality and food safety. First of all, you must have a good English language, at least to explain, at least to have the ability to communicate with others. Also, you must have mails writing skills, how to write a formal mail, how to write an informal mail, good Excel skills, the Pareto chart, and all the Excel skills. You must have good PowerPoint skills, good word skills to write reports and make documents. Also, the main important is have using internet skills, how to read, how to search on the internet, how to download, how to convert from different formats. Okay, there's other advices. Never, ever to give up. Be strong. It's a hard journey. Define your goal. You must define one actually. Try in different directions. Try in different websites. Try in different uh, companies. Try in different fields. Don't give up. Time is gold. Waste time, so you waste your life. Always read. You must update it. You must always read. Also, there is additional advices for you all. You must know about the trends, charts, analysis skills, Excel. Must know about the mini tab. Study about the beta chart. As I have mentioned before, you must have searching skills, leadership skills. You must know the profiles of the leadership. You must be self motivated. Sometimes you will not find anyone around you motivate you, so you must be self motivated. You must have the ability to train others. You must have training skills. You must train yourself from your experience. From your past situations to have a quick and right decision making and also very important thing about the communication skills you must have the ability to communicate with different educational levels and about the interview skills and your preparation this is a very important thing advices for you all to prepare yourself because later on we will have complete explanation the most important interview skills but before you have your interview you must prepare yourself about the following you must attend in the ideal time or before your time with half an hour or with an hour to have the to be confused from the environment or the place of the company you must prepare yourself with a success story at least a success or two success stories to have explain to, to explain these stories in your interview. You must review your certificates and your courses because you have mentioned it in your CV. So maybe the interviewer will ask you about these courses and what you have gained from these certificates and courses. You must also prepare yourself about your achievements and how you reach your goals. Also, you must prepare yourself about different challenges in your life or in your previous work. You must prepare yourself about your strength points and discuss maybe one or two uh, of these strength points. Also, you must prepare yourself about the weakness points. We not mentioned by weakness point, we can say area of improvement. And also, you must know about the company details, what actually the company are going to enter in it. Thank you again, everybody. Good luck for all. If you like the content, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, share the video with all the best wishes for all of you. Good luck for all of you. Thank you again. Great support. They will talk about the most important skills and advices to work in.